Purvis. If God were a dungeon master, he rolled a critical failure when creating me. No strength, dexterity, constitution, and definitely no charisma. I did all right on my wisdom roll, and I'm intelligent enough to be a feared magic user, but really, I'm the character you roll again when no one is looking. Thanks to Hot Pockets, Red Baron Pizzas, and Mountain Dew, I have more hit points than most 14-year-olds, but what good is that when my size modifier makes me so damn easy to hit? My name is Arnold Purvis, and I wish I'd never been born. Right there, my name. I take two steps into my homeroom at school and I hear the nickname, Arnie the Perv, only it's said in a terrible Austrian accent meant to mimic Arnold Schwarzenegger. Arnie the Perv. Even my so-called friends do it now. It's either the Ani thing, or my last name stretched out to a sing-song, Purvis. I suppose the name-calling is better than the all-out beatings. The only reprieve to my shitty life is Dungeons and Dragons. God may not be a dungeon master, but I sure the fuck am. I come up with shit that makes Tomb of Horrors look like your little sister playing Candyland. But I'm not out to kill characters left and right. I want to see my friends pour everything they wish they were in life into their fighters, paladins, and magic users, and then beat them down so ruthlessly that they want to cry like babies and give up. But they stick around knowing that I'll break the rules now and then and sometimes be like, those kobolds were defending a type A treasure. Those imagined riches in the game make up for shitty allowances and everything else taken from us at bus stops and lunch lines and on our walks home from school. In the game, we have some semblance of control over life. So yeah, on Friday and Saturday nights, I'm God. And I'll lay waste to all of Greyhawk if that's what it takes to release some of the pain inflicted on me during the week.